Hello. I have a magic, my magic mirror with me to see who's coming on. <laughs> and I also have a special guest. Guess who? I hopped in the car and drove up here. It's a beautiful drive. It's a beautiful, oh my gosh, the leaves right now. Mm. We've got some prettiness going Getting on, there. Y Come on in. But we both have dirty hair. She's yeah. going to the beauty shop I'm this afternoon. To, and I'm going to get that. I'm taking care of the Rudy business. I don't so. see any Rudy business. Well, it's right here. Look how dark. Right here. Right there. Look at my hair growing right here. Don't talk about it. I know. Don't, look We're going to talk right here. Look at this. Look at this hair. Look at this. My goodness. <laughs> what? It's, it's curly. curly. <laughs> I've never had curly hair in my life. I love it. So hello, we're saying hello to everybody. Hi, Jackie. I see Jackie. I see Vanessa. I see Natalie and Beverly and Tracy. Look at everybody. Look at everybody coming in. Eileen's here. Suzanne, I see you. <laughs> Here's to, um, where's my thingy? Okay, there it is. Here's to our conference tomorrow. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, we are so excited. We're so, it's do you so, see do you see my It's banner? Christmas sure. morning syndrome. Yeah, we are we're totally there. We are getting ready for tomorrow. You guys, we are on fire. Do you see my pretty banister? Marla just did that beautiful bow. There it is right there. Did the beautiful bow. We're going to be losing the TV and we are going to be pumping it up. You're going to see the whole thing. And I want to show everybody our I might, we might actually pull this up and go outside and show you the pretty leaves. We could so flip lovely. it around and... Oh, yeah, yeah you can totally flip, yeah. flip it and see it. Yeah. Hello, hello, I see Tracy and, and Mara. Pretty, pretty name. Lucy, hello. Jenny's here. Yes. Look at us. There's Martha as well. Who's drinking their hot milk mix? Hot we milk. are getting ready to... This is, we're breaking our fast. Mm -hmm. Y'all, I'm going to tell you... We have so much going on. We've got the Friday Q&A. Yes, we're going to get to it. Um, you know what our supplement of the week is, Marla. Beauty support. <laughs> 2.0. <laughs> it is the best. And if you buy three bottles, we will put the fourth one in for your cart free. We'll give them free shipping if you put ships free in the coupon code. That's if you live in the United States, of course. This stuff's flying out the door. Flying. Flying. And you know what? If you want to get some hair, <laughs> a little ex look at mine. Look at this fly. Look at this. It's, it's I've like never seen anything waves. like it. I know. I told Robert, I'm going to put you on beauty support because his hair is getting thin. <laughs> and he said, I'm not taking it. I wonder if I could get that on Mark. Sorry, honey. <laughs> He's upstairs. <laughs> Sarah's got hers. Good job. Well, you know tomorrow is the day. I don't want a single solitary soul to miss out on this. I don't either. And... You have, there's no excuses. We have told you that this was coming up for two months. 100%. So it's time to quit procrastinating. Get on it. Savingdinner.com forward slash cruise. We need well, light. Do we? We forgot to turn the lights on. I think the light is okay. It makes us look good. <laughs> we'll put some light on the subject okay. tomorrow. Oh, okay. We'll yeah, get we yeah. will. We'll put some light on the subject. I promise you. Right now, we're not doing anything. We also, I have something really exciting, Marla. Do show and tell with me. Okay. It's here. Here it is. Our skincare. And you know what we decided to do? Because we do have such a limited amount and we know that we're going to sell out in like 24 hours. Go now and buy the trio. You can buy the trio at savingdinner.com forward slash trio. We're going to do it's that so for pretty. a limited time. Isn't it so lovely? It's so pretty. And our Jenny did the labels. Do you know that? Oh, well, Didn't we just keep such it a great all in job? house. I know. We love it. And they're lovely. It has little dogwood flowers on it. Oh. And it has, that has essential oils in it. It's, it's such. That one does. And the rest of them. I mean, this I mean, one is. Look. You put this on at night, don't you? Oh, yeah. But you know what you can do? It would help me sleep. Oh, it, it's lovely. So what you do is I like there's this much and you know, I put this is how I do it. Um, this also works really well. I put two drops together and I mix it up. Now feel this. Feel how emollient it is. Oh wow! Isn't that lovely? You have such pretty skin, Marla. It's because I stay hydrated. I know you do. I'm sitting here. I'm giving her a little massage. <laughs> Cheers. I'm drinking to that too. We drank these. Anyway, but it smells 
nice and again remember there's no fake anything in it it's essential oils and stuff you can see everything about it go to savingdater.com forward slash trio grab it because it's going to be gone that's just how yep. we roll and if you put two hundred dollars in your cart we're going to send you a pinkies up cup marla's got one she I keeps do. hers in the bathroom but i then again she goes don't give me another cup but I've given them all to you. She's, You've got a collection. Robert's making me get rid of cups, <laughs> and I have my favorite mugs, and he just... I know, I know. But, you know, this is how we roll. So we're making... I'm making Marla make ribbons. Tomorrow she's going to demonstrate her very scientific way of making ribbons. You're not allowed to do it now. No, no. That's but, okay. but we have all this ribbon, this wire ribbon. She's going to show you exactly how to make ribbons tomorrow. We're going to talk gift wrapping. We're going to talk all of the things and as a matter of fact <laughs> you gotta bring bring the mister over here look at this <laughs> i'm dying over this it, it belongs in the macy day macy's uh, parade we just make our own <laughs> it's a blow-up turkey so we have everything we're going to show you exactly how we set up for the holidays the meals the shopping and everything and like i said if you're not there what's wrong What's going on here? Our quote of the week, who you are shows up in what you do, not what you say. I said that. <laughs> <laughs> quote yourself. I quote myself every day. In the Here's the quoting ourselves. <laughs> yeah. Patty and, and Jessica used to look for my quotes because I can't find my quotes. And I said, there's no reason to do that because I'm, I'm, I'm quoting myself I'm every quoting day. Myself, so I just <laughs> write something every day. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. And you know what the best thing, you know what the best part about it is? Um, the, you're the one who made a meme out of this. Do you remember? I mean, you made the little graphic out of it and it was on your website one time. And I was like, oh, I guess I said something worth, <laughs> <laughs> worth quoting. So anyway, that, that's been our lesson all week because people, I mean, we have had some amazing sprinting. Um, oh, yeah. I, testimonials I, have you been following them it's just fabulous it's been wonderful it has been wonderful so let's get down to the brass oh and by the way we love sharing people what does sharing mean caring, caring. see marla knows when you share that means you care marla does a countdown it's the best thing five ever. four three find the share button two one share publicly and say something yes because then we can find you to reward you with this lovely little gift bag. These are gonna, on Monday we're gonna do it. You've got the caramelized cacao beans, Kalima sea salt, and of course, pumpkin pie spice. Of this course. is from our friend, <laughs> of course, right now, this time of year. This is from our friends at Ava Jane's. When you share, this is the Saving Dinner broadcast. When you share, we check it out. You know, we're looking. That's why I say share publicly and say something. I don't know that we're doing it on our I've, I've got our Facebook page I know. too, so I, I don't know, know how to share that there. But hey, okay. do it for the love. Do it um, for the love. This is share. A, just a spur of the moment. She said, you brought your, your dual. The uh, dual thingy. Dual stand and yeah, let, let's do it together. And this is exactly where we're going to be sitting tomorrow, by the way. You will have this view tomorrow, except the TV will be gone and we'll have a little Christmas tree. Packages. We're going to do all the things. We're excited. We are. It's Christmas morning. We're making Christmas happen right now. And we'll have the lights on on the stairs too because there's little, we have a lot of AA batteries to be putting out right now. But anyway, we're excited about this. We're excited that you're here and um, we love sharing all this stuff with you. It's really super fun. Um, let me see where we are. What do we have here? So I told you about the supplement of the week. Don't forget, we're almost sold out. Grab it three in the cart. The fourth one we'll put in for you, and if you put ships free in the promo window, we'll do that for you. Go to savingdinner.com forward slash show. That's where our supplement of the week lives. Okay? Um, last night's webinar was incredible. You guys asked some really great questions. If you want to review it, savingdinner.com forward slash webinar, and we will definitely take care of you. And then let's not forget about our skincare. Man, are we going crazy over that skincare? And uh, I'll toss in, this weekend is the last you can get $10 off on our carpet sweeper. Oh, and if you don't have the carpet sweeper, please go get it. It's the best thing ever. And it's purple. Come on. And Who it, has a purple, purple, purple people sweeper? <laughs> 
pet pet hair sweeper. Yeah, it, it does works everything. great if you have pets. Oh, it works for everything. I'll never forget the first time I tried it on my throw rug in front of our fireplace, mm -hmm. and I thought the rug was clean because I had just vacuumed. And Wrong. I used a sweeper on it and opened it up. And there was a whole dog there. There's a whole, oh, <laughs> I, I was just, my mouth was hanging open. And so I just dumped it out on the rug on live, doing it live. Just to show. Just to show. I dumped it back out on the rug and swept it all up again. Just, I feel like I'm at Sears. You know at Sears when they used to do the vacuum <laughs> demonstration. Yep. You gotta Samples at Costco, but this was... I was just blown away. And oh, man. It was it was Chief's favorite place to lay, Aww. and so we. Chief was like a dog as big as a horse. Oh, he was. He was the sweetest. He looked like a sweetest. bear when he was hiding under he a bush. He was so sweet. He was a sweet puppy, but we got Tulip, and Tulip's Tulip's. Spicy. I love Tulip. She has a personality. She is a pet personality dog. All right, I told you it was Q and A. So let's get to the Q's, and I will give you the A's. How's that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to steal that. Yeah, you are. Because you do them on Thursday, I do them on Friday. Yeah. We have, we have a system, you know, always about the system. Um, this one's from Kelly. Please tell us about nutrition and macular degeneration. Thank you. You are welcome. Kelly, um, it's, you know what the, the bottom line on this is? It's all about the green. You know how, what a freak I am about green? One of the problems that we have is nobody ever ODs on greens. You know, you cannot overeat real food. Did you know that? You just can't binge on real food. Your body will cut you off. We have seen um, Dr. Walls. She, she cured herself with eight plates of greens. Eight cups of fruits and ve uh, eight cups of vegetables a day. She has four cups of greens, one cup of red and orange. And I mean, it's just like mind-boggling and I always say put it in soup that's how you can get it that's I mean that's your best way right and, and that's what we do with the hot melt sprint I like to put a handful a of spinach. spinach in my hot melt soup so smart and I get it's an extra boost mm -hmm. it's an extra boost and the dark and I heard you yesterday talking about the darker the, the darker the green the, is the, the, more the more nutrition nutrition yeah and that's how it is with vegetables remember that you go from if you have something that's dark and green on, on the outside and it's dark and green on the inside as well, you have got a nutrient-dense food. So a cucumber versus broccoli, there's, there's no, I mean, you'd still get nutrients, don't get me wrong, but it's really a whole lot better, okay? So those, that's one thing to know. The second thing that you need to know is that macular de degeneration is basically a nutri nutrient deficiency, not getting enough nutrition in. When your cells are happy, your mitochondria is happy. That's the energy center of the cell. And it really, really helps. So nutrition plus, I would just say go nuts on cruciferous vegetables. That's your broccoli, cauliflower, cabbages, Brussels sprouts, lovely stuff. Lots of greens. And just be thinking in terms of getting, I'm not gonna be quite as over the top as, as um, our friend Terry. But we don't have we don't, have, we don't have MS that either. She was trying to yeah. heal herself. She, if you don't know Terry Walls, Terry Walls is a doctor who discovered that all the medicine in the world would not take care of the MS, crippling, literally crippling MS that she had. So she went back into nutrition, did a deep dive, and guess what she did? One year later, she did a 17-mile bike ride before she was in a tilt recline wheelchair. That, that's an enormous thing. So... What we see is in nutrition, we see things start to, to even itself out and, and your, your body, that's why that's your it. body craves it. Right. The, your body's craving the nutrition and it starts shutting down different parts of it when it doesn't get it. And your body is, is really, is very, very wise and very smart. I think God made us fearfully and wonderfully made. And the thing is, is that when you're given what it needs, it, it wants to heal itself. It wants to take care of business. It can't unless it's got the right building materials. So watch, if you ever have a chance, watch um, Terry Wall's TED Talk. And she talks about being in a tilt recline wheelchair to finding out more about nutritional principles, applying them. She did a few other things and then being able to just completely change your life. And she's a remarkable woman. She's a personal friend. And I can attest to everything that she said. This she is not. She changed my life. She is, yeah. I mean, I I never thought about greens in the way she talked about yeah. them. Yeah, and she's passionate like we are about 
cows and nutrition, mm -hmm. she was passionate about greens and collagen and protein. And I've never seen anybody eat a chicken leg. <laughs> Oh my gosh, and I was like, no, don't do it, don't show me. When she broke the leg open and started sucking out the marrow, I thought I was gonna die. But you know, there's your collagen lesson right there, and that's why you know we, we talk about collagen the way we do. 97% of us have a deficit in it. So what I'm looking at here, Kelly, for and for everybody else who's listening, if you wanna avoid these things which are avoidable, and yes, you know, we, we all have constitutional genetic little, you know, dense in our in our bodies but that's not a death, death sentence that's not meaning that that's what you're going to end up with okay what you need to do is you need to take care of your nutrition you need to feed the cells when you're feeding the cells you're going to start seeing things turn around ask anybody who's in our sprint group i mean the pain going away and everything else inflammation it's um, remarkable. you actually get ankles again and fingers that's right no cankles say hello to your ankles uh, speaking of greens, this is from Norma. She said, how, mu how much greens should I put in my Target trifecta smoothie to replace the Just Use veggies? Um, do a handful of spinach. You don't wanna do too much more. You know what happens when you do too much? You might run to the bathroom. <laughs> you know, your body can only take so much at a time. So I just go by a handful. A handful, would I would say, of baby spinach is right around uh, about a cup. Okay. It's the same thing with our hot melt sprint mix, yes. and yep. it's it's sipping, it's it's sipping whiskey, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you just sip it. You don't drink it dry yeah, you don't, down straight. You're not gonna guzzle. So you just slow and steady. Sarah says her wedding ring fits again. Sarah's just she's just crushing it. She's doing all kinds of great stuff. So very exciting. Um, I love seeing all these stories and watching people say, I'm not in pain anymore, I'm getting off this medication and off that. And it's just, it's remarkable to see um, all these things happen. Someone is asking on our, our fly lady is, what's collagen protein? Um, it's a structural protein is what it is. So when you look at any kind of, when you look at um, a bone, for example, do you know there's more bone in your collagen than there is, uh, more collagen in your bone than there is calcium? Wow. Who knew that? Because we're always told about calcium, calcium, calcium. Well, calcium is important, but it's only one of the structural proteins, um, one of the structural minerals, whereas uh, collagen is a structural protein. It's in everything. It's in your fascia, it's in your muscles, it's in your tendons, it's in your bones, it's in your hair, skin, and nails. This is what makes your skin pretty. This is what makes your hair grow including this, you know, well, you know, of course. But all of these things, all of these things work together. And when you understand that you are 97%, you know why we're 97% of us are deficient in collagen? Because we don't eat chicken the way Terry Walls does. <laughs> you know, we don't eat the skin anymore. We don't eat the cartilage. We don't suck the marrow out of bones. You know what we do? We, we absolutely, we 100% miss the boat. We are buying boneless, skinless chicken breasts. There is no collagen in that. It's protein, but there's no collagen in I it. I tried to tell my neighbor yesterday about chicken feet. Oh. Chicken yes. feet bone broth. And she says, well, I've raised chickens. I don't know that I want to put chicken feet in well, they them. get cleaned. I said, you just have to wash them, but they have, and she has some degenerative disc disease. And mm -hmm. I said, you're you're having an issue with collagen. If you'll get some good collagen in you, and it, I said, those chicken feet, chicken paws, thank you very much, they they make the most gelatinous. Oh, they're ridiculous. Have you got any in your fridge? Uh, I have some in my fridge, I'll show you. I'll You've show got you. to see this. Yeah, yeah it's all nice and jelly, gel, gelatinous. It's, it's like jello, except it's jello for your body. It is. Oh, she's made a new batch. Just, we just did a new batch. And you know, this is this is a constant in our house. Okay. Grab a spoon. Well. Okay. All right. You ready? <laughs> Here it is. She cooks with this. She oh. heats it up. She puts stuff in it. I make soup out of it. She puts uh, her, her uh, sprouts in it. But smell, yum, yum. It's, it's lovely. 
It's lovely. It's like it's jiggling like it's, it's jello. It's, it's a little. It's not as jiggly because we didn't put as much stuff in it. Marla's gonna go grab a, grab a spoon. She knows where everything is in this kitchen, by the way. <laughs> Here she goes. But yeah, take a look at this. We've got a little fat on the top, but this stuff is this is good for what ails you. You know, look how thick it is. It's not your regular bra. Isn't that so good? Yep, yeah, it's amazing. Yeah. And I've seen it thicker than this. Oh, you've seen I've it seen where it it's the like consistency of, of jello. jello. Yeah, yeah, for sure. But this is amazing. Yep. Yeah. Marla knows that kitchen sink. Let me just tell you. That woman stands over it and does the dishes on Wednesday nights. Thank you. All right. So let's see. Where are we? So that's how much you should put in. And Jane's got a question. Jane, I'm sorry. I apologize. I apparently missed your question last week. Um, oh, here we go. She said, thank you. I listened to the replay on the webinar on collagen. I had no idea. I learned so much. You're welcome. Um, it's there for anybody who wants to watch it. Savingdinner.com forward slash collagen. You know, it's my whole goal is to equip women, give them the information, the education they need. Because I just found out, you know, when we know better, we can do better. Mm -hmm. But if we don't know... She said, I've recently looked at some of the studies about the effectiveness of glu glucosamine and chondroitin, which seem to be inconclusive. Exactly. <laughs> You're right. I used it on a regular basis when I was doing a lot of squats during weightlifting sessions 20 years ago. And as you know, I'm a runner. I don't have arthritis in my knees, just the frayed meniscus with use and age. Now that I'm taking so many supplements, I'm thinking it's not worth the money or time. I'm using the Perfect Paleo Protein and Bone Broth and believe it's helping the joints in my old deformed feet. What do you think? Thanks again for all the wonderful things you do. Jane, what I would do is I would, I would split test it. <laughs> you know, this is the best thing you can do. So if you already have, if you have the glucosamine and chondroitin, take it, put it aside for two weeks and just try doing perfect paleo protein and doing the um, bone broth. That's collagen loading. That, that's what makes our skin pretty. It also goes deep into the joints and makes your jeans, your, your, Boy, it makes you feel better, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Everything. Everything moves better, less inflammation. So give that a try. Then in two more weeks, add them back and see how you feel with both the collagen loading and the chondroitin and but um, the glucosamine. Recognize as each day. <laughs> yes. Have a scale of one to 10 on how you feel. Right, write it down. Use your food diary um, and write that stuff down because this is how we go back. It's this is our own contact tracing. This is A and B <laughs> testing. We it love is. A and yeah. B testing. It really helps because then we know, because we forget it's forced through the trees after, you know, we forget about, oh, well, I forgot about Tuesday, how I felt on Tuesday. And if you write it down, you've got a record and you can go back and, and look but at it. Set an alarm on your phone to ask you, how do I feel today? That's Say a it really noon. good idea. Say at noon and then again at three o'clock. And just write it down yes. on, on your calendar. 100%. And the other thing is I, I really commend you with your weight, um, with doing the squats and weightlifting and everything because if you build muscle, that helps to build the bone as well and it protects the bone. And as we get older, we all need that. I am adamant about that and that's why I'm so adamant about collagen loading because collagen loading is going to protect, is bone protective because we need that, you know? And that's why our CalMag on our core four is so good because it's a one-to-one -one ratio. Love that stuff. That stuff's amazing. It also is really good at sleep time, by the way. It helps with night-night time. All right, we have Margo. Uh-oh. Controversy. Ding, ding, ding. Do, should we ring a bell or something? I got a controversial question. <laughs> Hold on to your seatbelts. I'm 62 and have never taken a flu shot but now I'm thinking about it. Not the COVID-19 shot when it comes available, but one that's been around. I'm a semi-retired accountant that works at home in the suburbs. I get out a few times a week locally. My kids' grandkids, um, ages three weeks to four years old, live next door. What are your thoughts on the flu shot this season? Thank you. The recommendations are, the CDC and everybody else are saying, this year it's more important than ever. My recommendation is to do your research and to see what the research says. How effective is this season's flu shot? Because the efficacy is one thing that they do not advertise. You know, they, you can buy a flu shot, you can find a flu shot anywhere, but every year they're different. That's right, and they have to be. 
but they're using last year's strain to make this year's strain, which is completely different. So they're anywhere from 20 to 40% effective. They, they, they're, th that's how that works. But here's what I know. <clears throat> here's what we know, right? Yeah. Vitamin D. Vitamin D is, is the name of the game. Vitamin D, and when you're taking your CalMag too, it helps with that. Your vitamin D levels, in my opinion, are more important than a flu shot. And that's my opinion, which I'm certainly a total Vitamin to. D and vitamin C. Yes, absolutely. I mean, you can go but nutty on vitamin C. We have been taking doses, really great doses, of vitamin D for 15 years. Yeah, we have. Because of Dr. Neal. Mm -hmm. He was ahead of the curve when it comes... Way ahead of the curve. When it comes to keeping us healthy. And I can count on one hand and... Practically one finger how many times I've been sick in the last 15 years. Oh, same here. I just I haven't I mean, I the, the one thing I, I one time got um, some kind of a flu virus or something that I got from my mother where she lived in assisted living mm -hmm. You know that stuff goes around but the the point staying well is is you know, you've got self-care you got to get the sleep seven to nine hours is non-negotiable if you want your immune system on point you gotta take your vitamin D. Know your vitamin D levels, easy to do. You can get a test that you can do yourself at home. It's on Amazon. Yeah, I have right? one at home. Yep, I have a hint for you too. If you're gonna do a blood letting on your finger, which is how you do it, do it on the side. That's where you have less, less nerve endings. Make sure you're completely hydrated. Don't do it on the pad where you have tons of, of um, Oh, yeah. it hurts. Eddie, and it hurts like a Dickens. So, but always on the side, and I, side. I rotate between this finger and this finger. Yeah, we last year we were sticking ourselves like crazy three times a day, blood tests and all kinds of stuff. You need to know have this information, and then you'll need to know, you know, so that you, you know how how well um, how well you're doing. But you know, staying well and healthy means that you're washing your hands continually, you're using social discancing, and you're wearing a blasted mask. You know, I, I will not I think even this discuss flu season, this anymore. I think this flu season is going to be that the flu vaccine is going to get um, touted as being one of the best flu vaccines they've ever had because we're all being socially distanced. Oh. We're all washing our hands more. We're doing everything we should have always been doing. And there's going to be very little flu this year. I hope so. That would be just a great... That would be a that great be, benefit. We do, from we COVID. do not need a double. We don't need a double whammy. We we just need we last need, season. We really need to get through. Last this. season, my family had their flu shots. Justin, Emily, uh, Sarah, and Ethan all had flu shots. But they caught the B flu influenza. Oh no! And the I remember the, that. And they had a a rough go of it. It was and it was just bad. Mm. And I, Justin thinks he had COVID I in December. I remember he was real sick, yeah. In December. So, and it tested, it wasn't flu. So, I always get a flu shot because it's my gift to my husband. He asked me to do it. Yes. And I had to do it last year because I was with Ben and I couldn't get the flu. I was out and about much more than I ever had been. Mm -hmm. And I went to CVS and got a flu shot and it was free. Yeah, they do them free. So the point is, this is a very personal decision. There's people who are adamantly against any kind of vaccine or flu shots. And I'm not here to, de to, to debate that. For personally, how I feel about it is, I think more important than that is your vitamin D levels. I think everybody should know your numbers. You should know your numbers. You, when you get a when you get a test from the doctor and he says, oh, your cholesterol's just fine, make sure that you get a copy of your blood work. Keep that, we do. Marla and I both have well, I have files. a notebook of it. Yeah. I have a notebook of it that we, I keep. Them that's back. how you are an empowered patient, by the way. Because your doctor with works to the doctor. with you, not against you. MD does not stand for medical DOD, okay? <laughs> we, we need to remember that and, and we need to be able to work with our doctor and know what our numbers are and understand what we do. So. Do you take a flu shot? That's up to you. You do, but do your research. What do I have? Baby hair. I know, lots of Just baby lots hair. Lots of baby hair. <laughs> I know, isn't it? Lots? I'm sorry to get you sidetracked. I know, but right I'm, there it is. I'm seeing it. I know, baby. it's just insane. It's insane, and I'm getting my hair done today. Um, 
This one is from Linda and she said, should I be making my smoothies with full fat coconut milk? I love it. Here's what you need to know. The carton of coconut milk is just watered down. Cans of coconut milk is essentially it. And unfortunately, oftentimes what happens is they put this um, ingredient in there to get creaminess and smoothness in it. It's called carrageenan and it's a derivative of seaweed. And that can cause allergic reactions with some people to the point of like feeling like your mouth is kind of weird feeling, a, a rash might occur. So my suggestion is make sure it's carrageenan free. Silk is a good brand, by the way. Um, or get the organic canned coconut milk, which is like a buck. And then what you can do from there is, is uh, you know, you could just make it just take it and add a little, put it in a mason jar and add a little bit of water when you do your, your smoothie. It's good stuff. Um, MCT in there, medium chain triglycerides in the coconut oil. It is used that it's very high fat. It's good fat, by the way. It has a good mouth feel. It does. It has a lovely mouth And it feel. satiates. Very much so. And it's also used at, by your body immediately when they see medium chain triglycerides for energy then. It doesn't store which is good news. That is we good like news. we like that a lot. So there you go guys, that is your um, those are all of your Q's and there's all of your A's. <laughs> and we're getting ready right now. We're going to get off here and get busy and get I'm going to make Marla do more bows, of course. Yeah, we've got to do we've the got, stairway. We got to finish the stairs up. Oh, you know what? Let's show them the I'm going to bring this out side. They need to see the, the view. Guess we always talk about, oh my gosh. Oh, and don't forget about your body clutter skincare right there. This is very limited. We're hoping to get more in. You can get the trio at savingdinner.com slash trio. That's 10% off. And if you put ships free, we'll do that too. Okay, you ready? Okay, so here's my, this is everything. This is my little house. There's the stairs where Marla did the pretty, pretty bow. Isn't that lovely? I made her do that because I can't do them like that, but she's a, she's a pro. And here you go. Look, fall. Don't get too close to the edge. <laughs> I know. Right? Oh, if, my fall down. if we drop a phone, that's not going to be pretty. But there's fall. And over here, well, this is... Oh. See, y'all, I made my bed, and you didn't even know I was going to see. There's my bed. But here you go. Look. That right there, Marla. You're come too here. close to the edge. You're but you got to come over here. This is where the gorgeousness is. Do you see all that? Isn't that so pretty? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's down toward my house. I know it is. Yeah, I'm There's on the some... other side of that that ridge. Yeah, I come outside and yell, Marla. I hear something. It's a squirrel. They come. They go up in these trees and throw acorns down. Acorns. Acorns. <laughs> anyway, okay. Turn it around. Let's let's say goodbye. <laughs> Thanks, y'all, for joining. And don't forget, you want to share. Share and means like. you care. Share, like, and all that other stuff. Yep. And, and share to public. Say a little something about this. And we have goodies coming. Thanks for joining us. Bye.